Isotopes hockey team are serious about their hockey. Let's go. <laughs> but they're also serious about their community. They're dropping off gear and making a donation to the Britannia After School Hockey Program in East Vancouver. It's a great opportunity for playing hockey where kids haven't had the opportunity before. The startup costs alone would be upwards over $500 just for equipment. It's definitely an opportunity that a lot of kids miss out on. We actually had a look around at some of the other charities who were in need and we really wanted a uh, hockey specific program. We found that their little kids had tons of uh, donations, tons of support, but the teenagers, there's a real gap there and they didn't receive anything. Thank you very much, it's very kind of you all. The money comes from a recent calendar that the Isotopes did to raise the profile of their sport and some heart rates as well. A lot of uh, kind of put up poses and poses and they're fine with it. Beautiful calendar, they have to really see themselves to believe it. Well, a little teasing is well worth it. The team has raised a thousand dollars for Bash, which costs about ten thousand dollars a year to run. For us, what it means is that we get to keep our programming going. We're having some uh, budget issues, obviously, as everyone else is. And kids on the team appreciate the support. We're really lucky. They should have more programs like this. Thanks for uh, all the equipment and stuff we needed and everything. Uh, some of this other stuff is kind of old. It's a great opportunity to play hockey. Shaw in Vancouver for the Express. If you'd like to help out Bash, you can contact the Britannia Community Center. If you want to pick up a calendar, they're available at the Sports Exchange and Little Sisters Bookstore in Vancouver. It is pretty thematic today on the show because we're at the Surrey Art Gallery where we're setting the scene with more teens and more artistic talent.